Ah, uh, yes, I'm Zanzi. Welcome back. You feel good breakfast show, of course, and it is indeed World Milk Day. And what better way to celebrate than with a slice of creamy, velvety milk tart. Now, I know it's a classic. Everybody in SA must have had this once or twice. And if you feel like you're missing out because you can't do What's dairy, then check this out. You're in for an absolute oh. treat with all the goodness of our Good Hope Soy Vegan Milk Tart. It is soy good. Now, I'm going to ask Jamie Lee Dumbuck to come in and assist me with this one. We're getting nostalgic. You like milk tart? Soy good. So you good. <laughs> There's something about a milk tart that hits yeah. different on a Sunday. I don't know for you, like after church, oh, Sunday, yes. a cup of oh, tea. So I think yes. this is great, especially if you are a bit sensitive That's to like the gods food. Food. milk. You know, you Kassal. just come and skin her with the aunties and you just chat about what happened in the week. That's what you do with your milk tart okay, and your tea, so you know let, what I mean? Let us skin her with this recipe. Okay, so there's two parts to this, right? So we've got uh, step one, which I'll maybe just go through right now, and that's going to basically make the base, which is Crust. kind of, yeah, that crustiness. Mm. And that's really what kind of presents those two different textures in a milk tart, which we absolutely love, and then you'll be working on the insides, all right? So, and here's the thing, people will skin it about your crust if it's not good, okay? Oh, yeah. So that you'll be the topic of they skin it if, it's if your crust so is good. dry, it's not so <laughs> good. So you better work on this, and your Dawn is watching you right now, so... You're now, you put the pressure <laughs> on you, okay. Well, let me take you through my step, because it's very simple, and this is where you can start off with. So I've got some flour. Again, because this is a vegan meal, we are replacing the honey with maple syrup. Remember, honey is made from bees, and that's an animal and insect as well, so you stay away from that. So okay. essentially, I'm going to put some uh, maple syrup in here. Uh, I'm missing like a spoon or something. It. Let's just maybe have to share yeah, this can one. Use all now. of that. All right, so popping that in there, and then I've got some baking powder, and then some malted coconut oil. All Ooh. right, yes, yeah, sticking to the theme. So it's of all flavorful, vegan. still, yeah. you know, in the health bracket in terms 100%. of what uh, good oils we're using in this recipe. Yes, And that's going to be our crust. So you're going to get to that. Get to that. And let me just show you before, because I can finish this right now, right? So pretty much get it all done. You can open up uh, or you can get some ramekins on the inside. I just need to grab something to pull this out of. Oh, here we go. What do you have? There we Voila. go. So okay. essentially, fast forward into the future, once it's come out of the oh, oven, wow. it's going to start looking like something like this. Just be careful. Do not burn yeah, your hands. It is super hot. Woo! There we go. Oh, wow. Check it out. All right, so we put them in these nice, beautiful little ramekins over there, and then the crust is essentially done. And now what you do with these, they are quite hot though, so let me just pop it over to your side because it's going to be used a little bit later. As the filling. Yes, so now we're going to step over to the filling, and now we're going to talk about a hero ingredient as well. Before you get into anything, you definitely want to put a cup of that milk onto the pot in the meantime, just okay. to have that um, uh, going on too hot, and then you can get ready for the rest of your mixture. Definitely. And while we're at this, I want to talk to Mzanzi about this, because Clover's good hope soy milk is is exceptional. You know, it's a dairy-free option and it is great for drinking as is, but also like you can see right now, we're baking and cooking with it too, as of course a dairy alternative. Now it's also preserved and free, as well as a source of protein and good nutritional value. And that's Clover Good Hope Soy Milk, which is high in omega-3 as well as low in sodium. So we're ticking so many health boxes just by incorporating this. So we're not just being conscious for the environment too, but for our own bodies as well. I How are we going over here? Perfect. So we got our, our soy milk in, yeah. in. We got some cornstarch also going in nice. again. This is going to be our filling for our milk tart. Yes. Nice again, stuff. we always mess. Um, and then we're going to use some vanilla essence also going in there. Give you that mm. nice little, like vanilla. What's vanilla this? I was so waiting. What vanilla is this word? I don't know. Sometimes Vanillas. when I can't say something, I'm just like, you just have to dot it out, okay? <laughs> and then again, we're going to go in with some uh, maple, maple syrup. syrup. Yes, that's maple our syrup. honey alternative, which is fantastic. There we go. And that's going to go in. And then don't forget, the cinnamon goes on top. Don't be left to be so. You'll probably put the cinnamon inside the mixture. <laughs> I was, which is I was watching him earlier spreading lies to Mzanzi about the people messaging him on Facebook. I guarantee you he messaged himself. I said the same thing. I said, who do you pay? Who do you pay? Who you paid to do that? Uh, no, but I absolutely love it. And the fact is, though, like I, I, I must say, he has improved a little bit in the kitchen. I mean, I've he has. clocked some incredible recipes with Tabiso in this very kitchen. And that's the beauty of the show right now. And that's the beauty of this place. We get to make even someone that has no idea what they're doing in the kitchen to pull off an incredible meal that can impress the entire, entire family, <sighs> even the gogos. I mean, I mean, he gets away with so much. Tabiso, uh, come in here, man. We're just talking about you. We're just talking about your culinary skills. Yeah, a bit of advice. I would give you, Ryle, oh, wow. is when, when you're mixing things, right? <laughs> when you get in the bowl, the trick is always to go from the outside in, right? Okay. So what you've done here is a little bit tricky. Okay. What you want to do is you go from the out in and you fold in. You always fold inwards. Ah. Never just like this. Thank okay. you, Sensei. Wow. <laughs> it's fine. So it was someone 
on the message on Facebook. Please, yeah. uh, let him Zanzi know when your YouTube channel is coming out. <laughs> with Tabiso. Just watch the like show subscribe. every weekday from 6 till 9. But what else can I teach you guys today? What else oh, would you like wow. me to teach you? I don't know. Maybe you should stay here. Maybe you should join us for the next Kindly Conundrum. You can be our guest chef. That's easy. That's fine. Easy. Yeah. <laughs> Send your questions through 063408 And I'll be on standby to answer them. Fold in. Remember, always fold in. Thank you. Hi, okay, guys. Thank you. Let's, let's, go, let's get back to serving in Zanzi. As you can see, we have a nice little beautiful I just got to say, uh, maybe we should bring our raincoat start and stuff because it's definitely going to rain today after that. Uh, eh? I'm, I'm, Can I'm you scared. Believe it? I'm scared. He's like coming to teach us. Okay, so we have the beautiful filling. Nice. Looks like a nice little Let's coffee filling. Here. And we're just going to pop this in Ooh. to our, what did you call it? Ramekins. Yes, our, our ramekins. ramekins. Yes, we, we, we do it fancy Ooh, out here. I love Say that no thing. bowl. It's a ramekin. It's a ramekin. Okay. Yes. You're going to let this cool down. Uh, ideally, you want it to set. Pop it into the fridge. Um, so just it's nice little cool down and then you're gonna pop your cinnamon right on top and yeah. there you have it A soy good so good. It's so good. Milk good. I would definitely suggest any leftover innards or uh, the insides of this that you but do mm -hmm. have Put it in a bowl let it cool down because you definitely want to just chow on that later like a dessert on its own wait, wait, wait. Of course, Mzanzi, You can head over to expressoshow.com for this recipe inspiration along with everything else that we're doing on the show today We have definitely stepped up the bar when it comes to some of these meals We're preparing and this it is a dairy free alternative. It's using such a good soy good milk and uh, of course Mzanzi, you got to try this It is the perfect dessert on top of all the incredible meals that we have served you today. Hope you enjoy <laughs> Soy goodness from nature Source of plant protein. Naturally cholesterol free, lactose free. Made with love by Clover.